Well, good evening. Welcome back in. The weather headlines as we roll into the weekend are some big changes. We've got rain incoming. We've got gusty winds following that. The temperatures are going to plummet, and there's some fall things happening for us, of course, too, as we get into this weekend. The first thing I want to show you quickly before we dive into the forecast is our fall foliage report so far. As we look closer here at the state of Kentucky, we're in this yellow shade from the report from Explore Fall here. That's low color overall. Now, you've probably seen some trees really starting to get going. Going, expecting this to peak in the next couple of weeks here closer towards the middle and end of October. But the forecast is not great for getting outdoors and enjoying a lot of that fall like weather, mainly because of the shower chances that we have. As we go through our Saturday, we're going to see scattered shower activity. Temperatures 61 for a low 65 in the afternoon at best. And then we roll into Sunday with those temperatures bottoming out in the upper 40s to mid 50s throughout the day. And those breezy winds are going to continue to be a nuisance as we have UK and Missouri. Missouri plate tomorrow night. It is going to be in the upper 50s and mostly cloudy. You're probably going to want to bring your poncho or a jacket because it's not going to be warm. Those breezy winds are going to keep things rolling. We've got them all weekend long. Saturday coming in out of the west at 10 to 20, gusting up to 30 miles an hour. For Sunday, more northwest. Still same speed, though, for you as that cold front comes in. It is going to transition those winds around. Finding it on satellite and radar, not difficult. We see the rain. The actual change in temperature, though, is further behind that rain. A couple different bands are going to be moving towards us and that's been the next big the next big thing that we've been tracking for you here overnight spotty shower chances continue scattered into the early parts of tomorrow morning maybe a break from the cloud cover very very briefly but spotty rain comes back through the afternoon and we're just going to keep that rolling as we go into Saturday night and into Sunday morning and we're going to continue to see those spotty rain chances even into our Sunday evening with the cloud cover sticking around across the board Not a ton of rain through Sunday night we're looking at a trace to a quarter of an inch, maybe a few areas getting very thin, small, higher totals. But for the most part, not a lot coming your way on the rainfall front. You can track all of this on the Fox 56 Weather Authority app. It's got Futurecast radar on there too, so you can kind of track how some showers are going for you. If you are heading out to the game tomorrow or if you try to do something on Sunday, uh, even with that kind of crummy weather that we're going to see. It continues Monday and Tuesday, slowly climbing back into the mid to upper 60s early and in the middle of next week, but another system next weekend looks like it could bring us another chance for rain.